today for this wonderful service. We thank God for how he has led us through. We thank God for the choir. We thank God for the ushers, for the technical team. You guys did a great job today. May God bless you indeed in Jesus' name. Amen. At this point, I just want us to recognize a very special brother in our midst. He has been so wonderful to this ministry. Tongue speaking, demon destroying. Let's just put our hands together as we appreciate Brother Jude. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. A backbone to this ministry. Committed brother. Always there when you need him. May God increase you on every side in Jesus' name. Amen. Hallelujah. Shall we bow down our heads as we share the grace to close this service? The grace of the Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest and bow with us now forever. Amen. magnificent service today. Oh my goodness. She preached today. P-R-E-A-C-C-C-H. She preached. She was fantastic. Tell me what else you thought about her. Tell me. What do you think? She's just powerful. She's wonderful. Hey, my God, my God. God is using her a lot. Oh. Yes, yes. God is using her yes, to do yes, many yes, more. Yes, yes, yes. Wow. Hold on a second. Hold on. Hello? Hello? Yes, yes. Ah, I'm in the library right now. Yeah, I'm in the library. No, I'm in the library. I can't even shout right now. I'm studying right now. Yeah. Yeah, but I'll call you back after. I'll call you. Once I'm done, I'll call you. Okay? All right. Bye. Where are you? Sister. Are you in the library? <laughs> Sister, you have to understand sometimes now. You, you, you were just recognized by the pastor. And you're here lying. That is sin. Sometimes you have to tell a little. Come here, come here, man. Come here, come here. Let me explain something to you. Sometimes you have to tell a little bit of lies. Sometimes to get along in life. That is wrong. Lie is lie. There's come nothing on. like white lie or come lie. Come on. Or yellow it's lie. a little bit of lie. <laughs> no. Just a little it's bit. Unacceptable. It's unacceptable. It is sin. Reality. You're stressful. Besides, you're supposed to set examples for everybody. Hold on, hold on one second. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> Why is he calling me right now? Hello? Yeah, ah, I'm doing wonderful. I'm doing wonderful. How are you? Yes. Ah, right now with my father right now. He's giving me this business deal. I can't even leave right now. No, I can't leave. I can't leave. No, 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 no. I have to deal with my father right now. If I lose this deal, I lose him. Yeah, I'll call you back. I'll call you back. Okay. All right, bye-bye. Yes. Well, your father is in London. How come he's here? Sometimes. Well, listen to me, sister. Have you ever liked someone like before? Well, yes. I yeah, yeah, now we're talking. Sometimes we have to lie to get along in life. Just a little bit. Just look at me. A little bit of lie. You God no will excuse. understand. You have no excuse, Brother Jude. You have no excuse. What if the Lord comes now? What will you do? You start pleading. No, it's unacceptable. Anyway, I have things to do at home. I'll see you next week. Okay? Thank you, my sister. Thank, Thank you. you, my sister. And stop have a lying. Blessed. Stop lying. <laughs> it won't lead you anywhere. Have a blessed week. You we'll too. See you next week. Now. God bless you. We'll see you later. Right? Okay. Bye bye. Jesus, let me wait for my brother real quick, man. I'm trying to see where my brother is. Exactly right. Let me make sure, man. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. Okay. Let me think about this, man. Mm. Right. Yeah, he's almost here. Okay. Yeah, um, what's that song? <laughs> My God. <laughs> what are you talking about? You don't look at me. But no, you think you are. How can you bump into me? When you show what I'm I'm not talking to you. What do you mean? I'm walking on something in church and you bumped into me. Who do you think you are? I'm not talking to you right now. Okay, tell me what you Tell me what you Oh, yeah, tell me. Tell me. I tell you. Tell me. Talk to me. Okay, listen. I'm not listening to you. I'm not listening to you. Don't touch me. Don't touch me inside God. You cannot touch me inside God. Are you God? You cannot touch me inside God. You cannot touch me inside God. Inside church? Who do you think you are inside church? 
you know who I am? Do 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 you know who I am? Ask me who I am. Ask me now. Ask me. You are not. Ask me. I will answer you. You are not. Yeah, walk away. Walk away. Walk away. That's what I call walk away. Don't say it. Walk away. I'm walking. The big rubbish. Definition of a fool. Hold me. Hey, hold me. Inside this church. Hey, hold me. Okay. Let me relax. Let me relax. I'm in church. Let me relax. Okay. Let me relax. Let me relax. <laughs> my my little boy, I, I'm, you know I'm so tired today. I made up my mind to get some rest. It's been a very very hectic day. Um, what about your friends in school? How are they doing? Do you sometimes preach the word of God to them? You do that, right? And it's very, very important that you do that. Because um, as a child of God, you should be a living episode. You should make sure you preach the Bible, okay? <laughs> now, there was something you said you needed to uh, tell me the other day. Can you remember? Can you remember? God bless you. God bless you, young man. God bless you too. God bless you too. Have you been? Is everything great? See, see, as I was walking outside church, God led me to come back inside and speak to your life and speak to your destiny. That I have to preach directly to your soul that you might begin to receive God in your life. So has God directed me back into the sanctuary. My other, I would like for you to give your life to Christ today. Young man, your action is so loud that I can't even hear your voice. Listen to me. The other day I was walking by. Were you not the one that was telling a lie over the phone? Now you want to preach to me, not to tell a lie? You forgot the word of God that says in Psalm 101 verse 7. He that walketh the seed shall not dwell within my house. He that telleth a lie shall not tarry in my sight. The word of God says in Proverbs 23 verse 23. Buy the truth and sell it not. You forgot the word of God that says in Revelation chapter 21 verse 8 that all liars shall have their part in the lake of fire. Hallelujah. And now you tell a lie everywhere you go and you say it is a little sin. It is a little lie. Sin is sin. Are you not the one that was quarreling, fighting, and even cursing the other day? The Bible said that even in the mouth of Jesus, no guile, no vulgar word was found. Yet you want to preach to me? What do you want to preach to me about? You are not a living episode. The word of God says in 2 Corinthians chapter 3 verse 2, you are living episodes known and read by all men. Unbelievers do not have Bibles. But you are the Bible that they read. If they want to see God, they should see it in you. Your recognition did not go beyond the senses of men. You have missed it. Your services did not touch heaven. You are nothing but a whitewash. Heaven has rejected you. Sir. 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 Sir, please. Wow. God help me. 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 Listen, C. 
sisters. I don't know if that message has touched you today. I don't know if any one of us here can relate to what we have just watched. The Bible says that we are supposed to be ambassadors for Christ. We are supposed to be living in pieces. Are you an epistle today? In your place of work, in your apartment, in your homes, your neighbors see you as an epistle. You're that Bible that that unbeliever has to read. He will not carry any Bible to read. He needs to look at your life and use it as a mirror to examine his own life. You are a child of God. You come to church pretty much every time. But are you a living epistle? Does your life speak of Christ? Are you a representative of the, of the kingdom of God? I want you to bow down your heads today. We are all guilty. You know, in any way, we are guilty of this. I just want you to make it right to Christ today. Our Heavenly Father, we thank you for your word. 